So if you ever just wanted to annihilate opponents with jack-o'-lantern, well, uh, today I've got the build for you. Personally, this is literally just a copy-paste of my Cerberus build, so if you haven't seen that, go watch it, because that is going to be the fusion ingredient we will be using today. Also, this will require you to use two skill cards at the very least, but don't worry, the fusion path itself will have all the skills necessary, and so just inherit the skills you don't have cards for. One last thing, if for whatever reason during the fusion process you aren't able to transfer four skills, make sure both ingredients are high enough levels so that they at least have had the chance to learn the rest of their innate skills. With that said, let's break down Pyro Jack. So innately, he actually is pretty useful as he does learn Burn Boost and Soul Thief, which means that you can regain SP while having increased chance at burn. As far as what he needs to acquire from the fusion path, Inferno is just my personal pick for my fire skill, and although I do know that Blazing Hell has my range, this is his personal preference. Then we have Fire Boost and Amp for more damage as well as Ailment Boost to stack with the Burn Boost, almost ensuring ailments on your opponents. Lastly, I have Spellmaster and Enduring Soul. While Enduring Soul can't be swapped out for anything such as Drain Ice, Spellmaster is a must to counteract the costs of Inferno. Now that we broke down the build itself, the fusion path to get here really isn't convoluted. First, we will start with my Cerberus build, that once again comes from my previous video, and pick the 4 skills you want to inherit, as these 4 skills will stay consistent across the fusion path. Then you can fuse the Cerberus into a Slime, then to a High Pixie, then to an Arsene, which you must get to level 34, so you can fuse it into an Okuni Nushi. Then fuse it to a Queen Mob, then lastly to our Jack O' Lantern. Overall, this build is honestly a meme, and while I personally would never really use him, this is just for those Pyro Jack fans out there. Again, if you have questions or anything of the sort, feel free to join my Discord, as that will be the quickest way to connect with me. So, on that note, thanks for watching, hope you all enjoyed, and I will leave you all with a combo showcase.